So it's Blue Tune Husky back again with another video. And today I am. I finished my Lego Dead Mouse Cube. Now, if you've been watching my videos for a while, you probably already know I'm a huge fan of Dead Mouse. So, um, I finally got it finished. So, here it is the uh, Lego Dead Mouse Cube with Dead Mouse on it. Now this is really hard to build because, um, like it's huge, and the framework was difficult to build and to make sure it didn't wobble around. Because since the cube has to be tilted at an angle, um, I don't know what kind of angle that is, but uh. That it's supposed to be tilted at that angle, so like when you look at it from here, if you're watching his live shows, then it looks like a flat image. But like if you move it to the side, it looks distorted. Like it's a really awesome build, and um, took a while to build. It was but it was fun. Now, one of the hardest parts about this was building the actual cube. Like, getting everything to stay together so then all of it, like it would um, connect at like a 45 degree angle. Oh, no, it's a 90 degree angle. <sighs> Math fail. Um, yeah. Yeah, it comes to a point right about there. I didn't really care what the color of the plates on the inside would be because they wouldn't be shown. But yeah, this uh, round part is where the cube connects to its like frame, whatever you call it. Just holds it up so the it's not like like sitting like that. But here I have a little. Put that awesome move in there. It's got like a just built a bunch of things that looked like a synthesizers because he's got a bunch of analog stuff on stage. I got um, a little laptop here, and he's got this big touch panel thing connected to the laptop, and like he can like change sounds for the music. And uh, I thought that was pretty cool, but I don't have any stickers on it that look like the music stuff. So I just put that on there because it looked cool. And here I have a little little dead mouse. The head is actually 3D printed. So like, like if you wanted to 3D print this, if you had a 3D printer, you could just uh, look up Lego dead mouse on uh, Thingiverse. It takes about, uh, it took about like three or four hours. And I just got black t shirt and stuff. I kind of wish that the, the mouse head was, um, was angled a bit differently. Because then the ears could be pointing straight up. And it would look so much better. But. <clears throat> Alright, well that's that. So this is the Dead Mouse Cube. I really hope you enjoyed the video. If you haven't subscribed already, do that. And I'll see you guys again in the next video. Bye.